Good morning and welcome as we continue our daily devotions looking at Paul's first letter to the Corinthians. Today we're looking at 1 Corinthians chapter 10 verses 23 through 33 and I want to read just the first two verses of this passage for you this morning. Paul writes, all things are lawful but not all things are helpful. All things are lawful but not all things build up. Let no one seek his own good but the good of his neighbor. Jesus by his death and resurrection he has set you free from sin and the weight of accumulated guilt that would otherwise be weighing you down. But it's a mistake to think that that freedom wasn't costly. It was. Number one, it was costly for God. It came at the price of the precious blood of the Son of God, Jesus himself. Your freedom wasn't free. Jesus laid his life down for you. Number two, the thing to keep in mind is that the freedom that Christ gives, it's costly for you too in one way. See, in Christ you are set free, but that isn't a freedom to do as you please with no thought for others. It's a freedom that carries with it a weighty responsibility. Paul says here at the end of this series of verses, starting in verse 31, so whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do all to the glory of God. Give no offense to Jews or to Greeks or to the church of God, just as I try to please everyone in everything I do, not seeking my own advantage, but that of many, that they may be saved. Be imitators of me as I am of Christ. The principle, the key that Paul's laying out here in this series of verses is that Number one, you are freed from sin. In Christ, there is no more payment that has to be made that could be made. It is done and it finished. Number two, you are freed for service. You're freed for service to God, but more importantly, you're freed for service to your neighbors. So that as you serve them, as you help those who are in need, they might see the love of God in Christ reflected in you and come to faith themselves. Have a great day.